Hi, in this video, we're going to be looking at proving the famous tan chord theorem, which states that the angle between the tangent and the chord is equal to the angle in the alternate segment subtended by the chord. In this case, we want to prove that angle L1, which is the angle between the tangent and the chord, is equal to the angle at the circumference, which is N, subtended by chord LP. So, we're going to start off with a construction. And we notice that we have a circle with center O. So, we're going to join LO and PO. And that, in turn, makes LO and PO the radius of the circle. And we know that LO and PO are now equal. So, let's call angle N to be X. Now, if angle N is X, we need to find an angle in relationship to N. So, we have angle O, which is the center, and we know that angle O would be 2X, and the reason for that is angle at the center, is twice the angle at the circumference. Now, we're going to triangle LOP, and you'll notice that the base angles would be equal. So, we want to find angle O, L, P or PLO and we will take 180 minus 2x and divide that by 2 and 180 minus 2x divided by 2 will give us 90 minus x so we have OLP is equal to 90 minus x and your reason is radii some angles of a triangle so we know that these two angles are 90 minus x now we want to get to N1. So to get to N1, we know that angle OLM is 90 degrees. And the reason is that the radius is perpendicular to a tangent. Now if OLM is 90 and angle OLP is 90 minus X, by subtraction we will have L1 to be equal to X. Now, in conclusion, we have N is equal to X and L1 is equal to X. Therefore, we have L1, which is equal to N, and that's what we intended to prove. Thank you.